What's up guys, this is Cody here, and today I'm going to be showing you a brand new tweak called Mimir. Now, this tweak is a new multitasking tweak, and I think it's really awesome. I think you guys are definitely going to like it. Now, keep in mind that this tweak was actually submitted to Cydia last night. You're probably watching it in the morning. So, if it's not available in Cydia right now, I would just recommend following me on Twitter, and I'll be sure to let you guys know once it's live, and then you can go grab it. But let's go ahead and jump into this tweet because I think you guys are really going to like it. So let's say, for instance, that I open up an application like Safari. Now, to activate this tweak, all you have to do is swipe from the top left-hand corner, and that's it. And what it does is create that window of that application in the foreground. So no matter what you do, you can you know, swipe through your pages. Everything that you do other than in this window is going to be in the background. So even if we open up an application, that's going to be in the background as well. So you'll see right here that if we tap and hold on the title bar and drag it around, that we can actually move the entire window. Also, if we just tap on that title bar, then it's actually going to give us some options here. So we have the plus, minus, X, and then we also have a button right down here to change orientation. So right up here at the plus, if you tap on that, then it's basically going to make the entire window full screen again, or the application full screen. If we tap on the minus, then that's actually going to bring it down to a smaller window size that we preset in the settings. And I'll show you that here in just a second. Now we also have an X, so that's obviously going to close the window. Now a cool thing about this is, is you don't have to always have, you know, this window size or the minus window size, which is that one right there, which you can obviously, like I said, change. You can also use the pinch to zoom. So you can make this basically whatever size that you want once you get it into uh, this overlay mode. Now if we wanted to, you know, put this into landscape mode, we just tap on that and then bam, the entire application right there is running in landscape mode. So now let's say for instance that we wanted to play a video. That's another really cool thing about this tweak is that it has basically a built-in video pane-esque tweak inside of Mimir. So you can see that we're playing this full screen, well full screen in terms of it's using the entire screen or window right there to play the video. And I just think that's really cool. I'm just really happy that it actually works the way that it does. But now let's go ahead and close out of this and let's actually get into some of the settings. So the settings actually aren't going to be within the settings app. It's going to be in its own app icon right here. So if we tap on that, you can see that obviously you do want to make sure that this is enabled. And then right down here, you can change the default orientation. So from portrait to landscape, just depending on your preference here. And then right here, you also have your sizing. So you can change the default window size however you'd like just by swiping your finger across right here and it's going to change dynamically. So you can see what size you're getting right there. And then once you have that set up how you'd like, you can also change the minimize size. So what size does the window go to when you hit that minus button in that overlay mode. And then coming right down here, you also have the activation. So you can drag from the top left, drag from the top center, or drag from the top right. Now if you have any issues with sensitivity, of course you have that option right here as well. I haven't had any issues whatsoever, so I haven't even messed with this. But also coming right back down here, you also have your windows options. So if you wanna hide the status bar, you can do that right there. Also the pinch to resize, which I just showed you, and also showing the title text, which is basically just the name of the app. Of course, if you guys have any questions or anything, you can always launch the tutorial right here, and it'll take you through some of the basic steps of this tweak. So if you guys are looking for a new multitasking tweak for your device, I definitely recommend checking out Mimir. It's pretty cool. All right, guys, as always, if you have any questions, make sure you let me know in the comments. Of course, if you like this video, make sure you smash that like button. And if you guys want to see more videos on everything jailbreak as well as everything Apple, make sure you subscribe. All right, guys, until next time, peace.